see the Hart Road fire divided into two fires. Once that wildfire jumped the river, that one became the Cayuse fire and combined, they are burning about 14,000 acres. At least 20 homes have burned. And that's where KXY 4's Drew Reeves spent the day. He was in Wellpinit tonight. Into Wellpinit High School, and you may think students are getting ready for a rummage sale. But that's not what's happening at all. This all came about thanks to Facebook. Posted some things on, on social media and things started to come in. And things appeared to be coming in with no rhyme or reason. Coffee, jeans, water, toys. We do have a little bit of everything. Everything from corn to cantaloupe to crest. Now, I was thinking a few things uh, you know, when we put it out there, and then, um, yeah, it is pretty amazing. <laughs> amazing indeed. These items represent a community coming together to help when its members need it most. Well, there's enough items here for a small village, but 24 hours ago, this didn't even exist. In just 24 hours, Wellpinit collected all these items for their friends and family who lost everything in the Cayuse Mountain Fire. Everyday essentials like shoes, shampoos, and sheets. The reservation family is a family, and so you're going to help your family. And when Jolie agreed to help get all these items prepared for those families, it didn't take much convincing. I don't really know what else I'd be doing. I mean, I could be sitting at my house and you know, chasing a two-year-old around or... Um, I could be here, and this is where I need to be because, you know, this this is my family. In Wellpinit, Drew Reeves, Texas Hawaii 4 News.